To attach artwork to an image target in Adobe Aero, you start out with a new file and under Anchor where it says Horizontal Surface, you're going to click on that and drop down to where it says Image. It will ask you to bring in a picture as a background and I'm going to go ahead and bring in this koi picture right here. It could be a sticker or it could be part of wall art. Um, either way, uh, this is going to be our target. And um, then what you're going to do is you're going to come over and you're going to hit the plus sign to import more layers over the target image. And once you bring in a picture or uh, yeah, this is a PNG with a transparent background, you're going to need to rotate it uh, 270 degrees on X to flatten it out to go over the target picture. Now one thing you're going to notice is there's shadow over the koi and if I drop this down you can kind of see um, what you want to do with flat images in Adobe Aero when you're attaching them to image anchors is to go over to object and turn off the shadows because it's only ever going to cast a square shadow instead of the see-through nature of the images that you're attaching. So what you're going to want to do is just bring in your transparent PNG and drop it down. And then you want to use more layers uh, vertically. I have some files that I've already imported and I'm going to go ahead and make them visible. So I have this kind of water swirl and then another layer of water that's further down. You can kind of see it. And then also I have a copy of the image target just to get a little relief off the ground. And um, then also I have another fish, which is a blue koi. And then to top off the layers, I included some bubbles. And because uh, I just wanted it to have a abstract art appeal, but also make it kind of feel like you're in a koi pond. Um, one thing you need to do is make sure your images line up. For instance, this koi, it looks like it's not properly lined up with the image target. It would probably line it up um, once the software finds it, but I'm just gonna go ahead and make it perfect in um, the edit view here. If I press preview, it's gonna show us what it looks like. Um, we can add animation, we can animate the water, animate the fish but that will be in the next tutorial. So this is basically just attaching images to an image target.